Good evening, campers. It's me, Kira. Today we are going to talk about the 1984 science fiction novel by Japanese surrealist Kobo Abe, The Ark Sakura. For what this is, I'm not entirely sure. It's part of the Penguin Science Fiction Collection. I, I don't know if this counts as science fiction. It's dystopian. It's something. And if you couldn't tell that Kobo Abe was Japanese, just by delving into this, you probably would have guessed, because this is... <laughs> Only the Japanese could have written this. We have a legless bug that moves around clockwork just like eating its own feces in some twisted Ouroboros, which is, is somehow reminiscent of the entire book. The main character is called Mole, but he likes to be called Pig. We have a coup, an uprising around a the, like a really big toilet, of which Arbe says that three elephants could quite happily defecate with, with ample room, which is where our main protagonist is chained up when he's younger and is abused by his father, like on the toilet rim. And all this takes place in, in uh, on the outskirts of an urban landfill underground. I have no idea. I have no idea what the Ark Secure was. I'm baffled. However, Murakami's depiction of women uh, pales in comparison to this. There's a moment where a woman is shooting a gun and the translation advises that like all the men were like, wow, I wonder what's up her skirt. Confusing. It was absurd. It, it, w it was... It, 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 I don't know what it was. I don't even know if I can classify this as a book review because I'm so bamboozled that I have nothing coherent to say about this because in the end, nothing matters and the girl rejects him. The Ark Sakura is one of those books that I can categorize and uh, I, well, I've read it. It's just strange. Things happened. I'm not entirely sure why. Make do with this video as as you please. Do, do what you want with it. I have, I have, I have nothing more. I read it. Baffling.